Welcome to City News Dhaka English Bulletin. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina today emphasized accurate and innovative action plans and effective monitoring systems with collective efforts to achieve the Sustainable Development Goals SDGs, by 2030. It is challenging to ensure the implementation of the SDGs in the stipulated time. But, still, I believe that it would be possible to reach the goal through accurate and innovative action plans, effective monitoring systems and collective efforts, she said. The Election Commission EC, will begin updating the voter list from May 20. Enumerators of the EC will go door-to-door -door for three weeks from May 20 to collect information on prospective voters. The representatives of EC would collect data of citizens who were born on or after January 1 in 2007, and they would gradually be included in the electoral roll when they turn 18. Those who were dropped during the last voter list updating will also be enrolled as voter, according to the EC. At least 14 people were killed, and more than a dozen others injured when a bus carrying domestic tourists crashed into an advertising sign in Indonesia's East Java province early on. Monday, police said. The bus which was carrying 31 passengers, the driver and a crew member, hit the pole and then rolled over on a toll road connecting the town of Mojokerto to the country's second city, Surabaya. Ukraine was preparing Monday for a new Russian push in the eastern Donbas region, as Kyiv said its army's counterattack around Kharkiv had gained momentum. Since failing to take the capital at the beginning of the invasion in late February, control of Donbas has become one of Moscow's primary objective zero, but Western intelligence has predicted its campaign will stall amid heavy losses and fierce resistance. Bangladesh clawed back to the first test strongly after off-spinner Naeem Hassan set the platform, registering his career-best bowling on day two of the test at Zahir Ahmed Chowdhury Stadium here today. Naeem ended up with 6-105 as Bangladesh bundled Sri Lanka up for 397 in their first innings and then the openers batted aggressively to end the day on 76 for no loss in just 19 overs. Thank you for watching. 